now let's talk about a really useful tool, kind of like a very big undo button. Uh, first off, let's just go ahead and delete a huge chunk of text from our book, our chapter one. So let's just go ahead and pull that up. And this is the beginning. I mean, let's just destroy this file. Let's just delete a huge chunk. We're going to delete the whole two first two paragraphs. Um, and let's to delete random stuff in here, uh, you know, blah, 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 blah. Just have fun destroying this thing. And, you know, clearly now, let's save it. You know, I know you're thinking, Joe, you're crazy. No, no, no don't worry, we're going to fix it. <laughs> um, so let's go ahead and look at our git status. And that's going to say, hey, you modified chapter one. And let's say something has happened where we don't remember, you know, the change that we made. And so, you know, then what would we do? Well, we should use git diff that's going to show us the changes that were made. So it's going to say, Joe, you changed a ton of stuff. Look at all these weird files you changed. And oh my goodness, it's like, you know, I didn't mean to do any of that. I should not have done any of that. I want, I want the red. I don't want to push this new file up there. I want this, all this red stuff. That's what I want. So then what you're going to do is you're going to use this really useful tool called git checkout. Now, git checkout is going to go up to the publisher and say, hey, publisher, I need th that package you sent me. Can you show me that package? Because whatever's in that package, that's what we're going to use. We just want to go back to whatever's in the package, that latest commit that you have. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do git checkout, and then I'm going to do chap one. Because I'm going to say, I want to check out that last chapter one I sent. So it's going to replace it's going to do the opposite is pretend this is a minus sign it's going to get rid of that and replace it with this so let's go back here and take a quick look this is what our chapter one looks like now it's got the missing the first title the omuses and it's now nep is all screwed up so i'm going to do git checkout chapter one and now if i do pull up this level oh and it fixed itself so now it's back to the original so that's a very useful tool when thinking about, you know, oh, I should have just gone back or I just need to revert. It's, it's, it's kind of like a little uh, gr bit giant undo button. Most of the times you're probably not going to use it in that way, but checkout will become a very powerful tool in later videos once we talk about branches.